What's up, y'all? I'm sorry. Back with another reaction, y'all, from the Fat Man's podcast. I got another reaction for y'all. But before we end, before we get into this video, please hit that like button and subscribe button. I'm trying to hit 50 subscribers by the end of this month. If not, we'll do it next month. I'm trying to hit 200 subscribers by the end of this year. So please do share this video with everybody that you see. So let's get in this video, y'all. I got another Desolate Peterson video for y'all. I see y'all like these, so I'm going to start doing more. I just did part three. We're going about to do part four, y'all. So let's get in here, y'all. And y'all might hear all that water in the background. That's just the washer going on, going. So I'm sorry about that, y'all, if y'all do hear it. Sure, I'm a slut. <laughs> like, let's go back. Are you a slut? Dang, Jesse. He do not care. <laughs> sure, I'm a slut. <laughs> wow. You've been telling me all day. It's a woman want to be able to do whatever she want with however many men. And whatever she want and not be called a slut. Do you agree with that? I mean, yeah, because men have it that way. What is wrong when men do it? I mean, men just don't get shamed for doing it. They get praised. I know, but it's still wrong when they do it. I mean, I, I get, I don't, how's that? I don't think it's wrong. He, he's definitely right. He's definitely right. He's like, just sleep with every woman and every woman that you see is still wrong. It's still like, damn, like, like, you, do, do you not have any, like, any, any pride in yourself you know not every woman deserve you to push your not everyone that not everyone deserve your you know your your stay you know what i mean but yeah let's get up in here when anyone does that i think people should just be able to do what they want to do without shame from society i don't think they know well you can't take shame out of society that's why everybody being so so sensitive now these days because you because shame i don't know Shame should be a good thing to me. I think I think it builds people. I think it builds people thick skin and stuff like that. I think you're shame for everything. I think I believe in shame. So I don't know. I don't, I only hear a woman that say that. I, don't, I never heard a man say that. I really know why they are here. Are you, you say you have children. I do. Are you married? I'm not. And do your children know that you are a slut? Do my children know that I'm a slut? My children know that. <laughs> Duffy, damn, bro. Oh my god, you said it. Do, do, do you know your does your kids know that you're a slut? Damn. But I'm an empowered woman, absolutely. Do they know you are a slut? That's not that's not a power if you want to be a slut or a a, a a lady of the night. My children know that I'm an empowered woman, and if that means that I'm a slut, then my children are gonna know that I'm a slut. So they don't. That's sad. That's sad. Yeah, your kids gonna be fucked up. No, right now that you're a slut. My children know that I'm an empowered woman. Are you gonna eventually let them know that you're a slut? Are you gonna let <laughs> your children know that you're asking women if they're sluts? And then why are you? Yeah. You're attacking you why are you attacking you it's on the public platforms i mean they might come they might come around it you know what i mean me calling saying that i left my people but i think just the piece only got one kid you look you wound <laughs> up leaving when i say your people maybe i shouldn't have said your people because i know that that that's the thing you're yeah. you're hanging your hat on there. you know why you uh, said your people because you hate black people and oh, you don't want to see you, you don't want to see a free black person oh what? you're such a fool you, you, <laughs> you are a you democrat the same place, you are a democrat who does not want to see a free black person leave the plantation that's, oh, you that's are, what you're look, well, that's what you're telling uh, me. he's talking about their mind saying not the you know not like man but like he's definitely talking about the the free mind of you know nobody's trying to hold you back or anything like that i definitely agree with this lee peterson saying <laughs> you a troll man oh, sorry. you're a free man you're a free man to be a fool and, and, that, that and you're unhappy that about that show. and you're unhappy about that I, I, look i'm only unhappy because i, I see no you i gotta take the break jesse thank you that's a democrat for you folks <laughs> Give me an example of black people being oppressed. One example. One example. Yes. Oppression, slavery. Slavery doesn't exist today. True. 
It been over it 150 years ago. Give me another one. The results of slavery are felt every day. No, no, no. Lining. Red lining. No, not true. Red lining is because black people, uh, representatives wanted that because they wanted to try to get, and they're Democrats, they wanted to try to get as many votes as possible. They brought that up. It was their decision. I don't know nothing about that, y'all. Uh, I don't even know. I don't, I never had, I never seen red line before in my life. Every big I've been through, I got what I wanted. Anything else? Um. And a lot of black people complain about it, but like, if your credit fucked up and you don't have no credit, usually they wouldn't give it to you because you have not built your repertoire of credit or loans or anything, car loans or anything like that. Especially if you don't pay them or nothing like that. Especially if you get bad credit and stuff. A credit, a credit, a credit, credit report is just like a damn rap sheet, to be honest, of how you pay your bills and stuff. Uh huh. A voter fraud. <laughs> Look, she can't. She can't even come up with nothing else. You're just making up stuff. <laughs> hey, do you do you respect yeah. men? Do you respect men? I, I respect people who show How about a high moral character and don't peddle lies and disinformation to the American public. This is like, okay. answer the question. I never understood why women do that. Like, not just answer the question. It's not that hard. You answer the question first before you put context to it. Answer the question first and then put context to it. Public. Do you respect men? I. I Sure, yeah. I you respect do. men, but I judge people as individuals. Amazing. But then you don't want nobody to, then you don't want nobody to judge you. That's crazy. Well, I want you to know that President Trump is the greatest president that this country has ever experienced. Barack Obama oh. the worst. I'm so and sorry. in spite of you guys you guys hatred for him. He will make America He's great not going again. To make America and so great. your Sorry, article, your, your article said it's that very Trump. Nice to talk to you. Uh, have a your great article day. said that Trump is. She ran. She yep. gone again. <laughs> your article said Trump ship might may finally be sinking. Wish for thinking. And because he didn't agree with Barack Obama, you think that he's a racist? Yeah, off top. But Barack is a Democrat, the president is a Republican, and Republicans and Democrats don't agree. So does that make them racist? No. Yeah. They can't take so much taxes out of your paycheck, that and means. now you bring more money home starting February. This what's, what's wrong with your black folk? Why you always say the dumbest stuff? <laughs> In 2018. Is that a good idea? Yeah, that's a good idea. He done got me there, all right. <laughs> he got me there. Also, he cut back on restrictions and regulations where you... I think most people just uh, just follow what the trend is in the black enemy F, F Donald Trump. Like, most people just follow what they what their parents see and their friends see. You can now start a business if you want. It's not so hard where the Democrats didn't want that. The president made it where you can do it. Is that good or bad for the people? Good. That's good. Yes, we are all sluts. You're a slut. All these dudes behind you are sluts. Your cameraman's a slut. Your PA's a slut. Thank you. And your mic's a slut. And what made you a slut? Because I own my body. My body is not a political playground. It's not a place for legislation. It's mine and it's my future. And a slut is just a word that you and your fellow penises made. A slut. Your mama's a slut. Your grandma's a slut. Everybody is your mother a slut? No. Wait, <laughs> Wait. why are you gonna call everybody else's uh, parents sluts, but yo ain't? That's crazy. But yeah, y'all tell me what y'all think. Y'all tell me what y'all think up in the comments. Definitely, Peter's a I would call the master of trolling people, man. A like master, and he's a straight face troller too. Like he just like you a slut? Do you? Are you are you a slut? Uh, are you a lady of the night? Is your mom is your mama is your mama lady of the night? Did she like uh she like, <laughs> she like uh no 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 no. So how you gonna call everybody else um uh, moms a uh, lady of the night? All right, yeah, that's the end of the video, y'all. Y'all tell me in the comments what y'all think. Y'all tell me.
<laughs> about the last one too. She's funny. Hit that like button, subscribe button. I'm trying to hit 50 subscribers by end of this month or next month. I mean, after, if we don't hit it this month, we'll hit it next month. And I'm trying to hit 200 subscribers by end of this year. And I will see you guys on the next one. Osiris is out from the Fat Man's podcast. I'll see you on the next one.